Fast and Furry, Understanding Speed Sharing in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English learning channel. Today, we're going to dive into an interesting phrase, speed sharing. It's a term you might not hear every day, but it's a great example of how English can combine words to create specific meanings. So, let's share away any confusion and get right into it. Speed shearing is made up of two words, speed and shearing. Speed refers to how fast something is happening. It's all about quickness and rapidity. On the other hand, shearing is a term often used in farming and agriculture. It means to cut off, typically referring to the removal of wool from sheep. So, when we combine these words, we're talking about shearing wool off sheep very quickly. Now, let's see how speed shearing is used in real-life contexts. Primarily, it's a term you'll hear in rural or farming communities, especially during sheep shearing competitions where speed is key. Participants try to shear sheep as quickly and efficiently as possible. It's not just about being fast, though. Skill and care are also crucial to ensure the sheep are not harmed. Interestingly, speed shearing can be used metaphorically. In a broader sense, it could describe any activity done quickly and skillfully, especially under time constraints. For example, he's speed shearing through his homework, implies someone is completing their homework very quickly. Understanding phrases like speed shearing helps in grasping the flexibility and creativity of the English language. When learning such phrases, it's helpful to 1. Look at each word separately. Understand their individual meanings. 2. Combine the meanings. See how they work together to form a new concept. 3. Consider the context. How is the phrase used in real-life situations? And that's speed sharing for you. I hope this video helps you understand not just this phrase, but also how English combines words to create specific meanings. Remember, language learning is a journey, and every new term you learn is a step forward. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.